Hello. Hey. I'm here to tell you about love. You're thinking at the back, there is absolutely no way you can dress an egg in that cardigan and have it tell us about love. <laughs> what is that? Are they lapels? Is that is that is that business casual? It would be very brave to dress an egg in that cardigan and have it tell us about love. The kind of bravery that only someone who was desperate to get promoted within the BBC comedy department would take. <laughs> Believe. I'm here to tell you about love. I'm qualified to tell you about love because I have recently been watching a lot of online documentaries about love. And love <laughs> so many that I can't even count them on my free hand anymore. And what I've learned from these documentaries is that there is absolutely no way you should watch them with the door unlocked. Um, my girlfriend keeps coming in like, oh my god, you are disgusting, you are disgusting. Um, you absolutely cannot watch those things uh, when I'm in the house, you shouldn't. Um, I'm like, well, it's educational, I'm learning. You know, this is how I learn, I see and I do. Um, you're not learning anything, you're just watching that man subjugate her. Well, I'm learning new words for a start. <laughs> I knew it was illegal, but now I know what it's called. Turn around, and you'll see her be subjugated by two other guys and a horse. Stick around. There are hundreds and thousands of sexual possibilities. <laughs> God, she's gone, she's in. As you can probably tell, I'm reacting quite strongly um, against uh, being completely emasculated by my much cooler than me girlfriend. <laughs> the cardigan screamed, help. <laughs> I stepped out of a club the other week, and... Um, got the call that all men should be making themselves, but I received it saying, hey, do you want to come over for snuggles? I was like, <laughs> bitching. <laughs> a real man would absolutely receive that call, be like, yeah, straight to the kebab shop, pick up a kebab, kick through your door after I get the cab ride over, just be a bit sick back of the kebab in your bin, try and do you over your coffee, ta your coffee table, I don't really know what I'm doing, I put it kind of in your thigh and then I pass out on the floor. I want to wake up.